Welcome back to the channel. French Montana was just on the Mav Hoffa podcast, and he echoed something that we've heard a lot of rappers say recently, and that's that being a rapper is one of the most dangerous professions in the world. But he also said some things that was kind of surprising. He said that not only were him and Chink shot by people that they knew, but that the Chink's killer actually showed up to his funeral. Take a listen to this clip. I gave Chink's money to get out the hood. What? Chink's came to me like, yo, I need a car. I need to get up out the hood. I gave him money to get out the hood. He thought he was getting out the hood. He bought a crib three blocks down. He went and bought a crib like five blocks down from the hood. Bro, it's just like your man, your right hand man died and you don't know who did it and you ha and you gotta live in them, in them, in them, in them situations for the, until they find the nigga who did it. You don't know if it was a head out for you. You don't know if you did Dang. something wrong. You don't know what's happening and you still gotta be around the same niggas. Then when you, when, when you rewind the clock and you really look at the nigga that killed Chinks was at the funeral. Wow. Mm. These are the type of situations that we live in. Right. That's why being a rapper is, 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 is fucking worse than being an Iraq. You know what I'm saying? That's mm. the type of situations we live in. The nigga that shot me came and broke fast the Ramadan on my, me and my mother at my house. The nigga oh, that killed Chinks damn. went to the, to the funeral wearing a yeha 